These gentlemen are helping me with a brand new research project on the topic of neurorobotics. In this particular case, we have something that may not even look like a robot, but it's the first phase of what we call a hexapod that would eventually have possibly six legs to move like an insect. Kairul and Bhuti are exploring different techniques for building robots that can be connected to neural controllers. So we are using it like a manual controlling system. Uh, where my friend Bhuti, he is working on like the Arduino programming things. This device is the microcontroller, which acts like a brain. One of the problems with understanding how to control robots is artificial intelligence still can't achieve what the human brain can achieve. I am part of a group of neuroscientists that believe that understanding motor control and how we actually move and function with our bodies is pretty much the first step in understanding the brain. One of the key advantages to working with a system like this is we can actually do the kinds of experiments that neuroscientists would like to do where we understand how the brain can actually control a physical body in the environment. 